Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, I'm Nicole. If you could please subscribe to my channel, turn your notification bell on, give this video a thumbs up, and leave a positive comment. I do appreciate it. In today's video, I am going to be unboxing the August 2020 Allure Beauty Box. This is a $15 a month beauty box, but they are going to be making some changes, so I might either make a separate video about that, or... I may insert um, a screenshot of the email I received so you can see what they are going to be doing with the changes. When you open it up, it always has the little booklet inside and the little tissue paper. And it is jam-packed full of goodies. There's... Um, this is what's inside. I cannot wait to show you everything. I'll just go ahead and keep up with this booklet. And right off the bat, the first thing is a full-size product, and it is the Pixie Rose Oil Blend. Um, it says, this oil has quickly became one of my favorite multitasking products. Um... It's made of hydrating oils, sweet almond, orange peel, pomegranate seed, and rose oil. For the record, I'm not the biggest fan of how roses smell, but here the flowery scent is subtle and soothing. When I apply this oil, as the last step of my nighttime skincare routine, the floral scent reminds me that it's time to relax and helps me wind down. The formula absorbs instantly, and I don't have to worry about waking up with oil stains on my sheets. For mornings when my skin could use a glowy boost, I add two drops to my moisturizer or foundation. You can use it to sheer out full coverage makeup or press some on cheekbones for a dewy finish. And the cute mint green bottle and dropper get this product bonus points. It's $24. You can get it at pixiebeauty.com. Enter pixiexeller15. At checkout to receive 15% off your order, excluding certain items and sell items, valid July 31st to October 31st. So um, the dropper is separate, and then here is the product. It is one ounce or 30 milliliters. And it does have a very light rose scent. So if you do have a sensitivity to scents, this should not bother you due to it being a very light scent. Which is nice for those who do have a reaction to scents. The next thing is this First Care Activating Serum. Um... When I started getting serious about skincare, I expanded my then three-step routine that didn't include sunscreen, yikes, to nine steps including two serums. I'm used to seeing hyaluronic acid, vitamin C, alpha hydroxy acids in most serums, but this formula has a blend of five Korean herbs. The ingredients work together to hydrate, brighten, and firm the skin. I'm in my early 20s, so there's not much to firm. But anything with hydration and brightening ingredients is great for my dehydrated and hyperpigmented skin. I use the serum after cleansing and toning and it gives me a subtle glow that I love. Full size price is $84 and you can get it at Sephora.com. This is 0.27 ounces or 8 milliliters and this is the packaging. I cannot wait to try this because... I hear Stargirl Beauty talk a lot about Korean skincare, so I am excited to try this. If you do not know who Stargirl Beauty is, I will be leaving her channel linked down below so you can go check her out. The next thing is this Sea Mud Deep Cleansing Bar of Soap. And it says, Adam and Eve are given every pleasure in the world and still wanted more. So I suppose it is in our DNA not to fully appreciate perfectly good things. The humble bar is 
a great invention, yet we wanted face washes, foamier, creamier, fragrancer. Well, not we, as in you and me. I have always loved and used uh, Laszlo's Solid Face Wash Bars, which recently relaunched with this all-paper packaging, the Seema Deep Cleansing Bar, the brand's most classic product, in, uh, into an inky, inky liquid that gently rids my face of the grime it collects during a long day of typing words into the internet after I rinse my skin. It uh, a thorough cleanse, and I can feel wind in my pores. It is $38. Uh, you can find it on their website and enter alert 20 at checkout to receive 20% off your order. The next thing is this Floss Brighten Up Highlighter. Nicely bubble wrapped. The only other thing I have in Floss is a lip gloss, which I have not tried yet. But the packaging is similar to this. And this is what it looks like. A really nice color. Looks like it could give you a soft glow and be buildable. Um, I will read you a little bit about it. It says, I like to look shimmery but not like I glued glitter directly onto my face and that's exactly the effect this pressed power highlighter creates. To apply I use a pointed fluffy brush that I swirl into the pan before sweeping across my cheekbones, down a bridge of my nose, and on my cupid's bow. One pass delivers a barely there glow that's perfect for daily wear and I just repeat the process for a highlight with slightly more impact. Sunlight shown here. Looks like a champagne at first glance, but it transforms into a subtle gold on the skin. It is $20. You can get get it at flossitup.com. Enter alert 20 at checkout to receive 20% off your order. Valid August 1st to October 31st. The next thing is this H2O Hydration Sensitive Gel Cream Moisturizer. 10 milliliters or 0.34 fluid ounces. And here is what it looks like. Close. And it does have the safety seal, which is a great thing. A little bit about this. It says, uh, Tea has been my drink of choice lately. Not only has my oily skin been breaking out more than usual, but I've also been experimenting with acid toners and at-home pills that sometimes leave my face feeling sunburned. Slathering on this H2O Plus moisturizer is the ultimate remedy. The petal pink goo is spiked with camille oil to reduce redness and irritation, and the formula also features calming and hydrating products. It's oil-free, but still has a rich thickness that offers immediate relief. Full size is $42. You can get it at h2oplus.com. Enter alert 15 at checkout to receive 15% off. Valid August 1st to September 30th. The next thing is this botanical primer from Wish. I'm assuming is what it's called. I could be wrong. If so, I do apologize. It says right off the bat, I knew this primer was different because in addition to Aragon oil and aloe, it contains a gentler natural alternative to retinol. On a day that I decided to give it a test drive, my skin was looking especially dry. But a few minutes after applying this creamy primer, my dry spots were smooth. The blurring formula faded the red blotches on my chins and chin and cheeks. And my pores, even the large, large ones around my nose, had all but disappeared. Ultimately, this primer makes it so you need less makeup. Most days, though, I've been wearing it on its own as an extra layer of moisture that hides any imperfections. Full size is $44. You can get it at wishbody.com. Enter alert 25 at checkout to receive 25% off your order. Valid August 1st to October 1st. And the last thing in this box 
is this look and may brightening lift up perfect fit mask and here is the packaging on it it says one of my major skincare projects during the isolation period has been working through my huge collection of sheet masks Lux and May is a K-beauty brand that recently launched in the U.S. and the illustrated packaging is what made it stand out of the pile. The mask is made of a super stretchy material that keeps it from sliding. It's also soaked in a serum that contains niacinamide and vitamin C to brighten and, bun and a bunch of floral and plant extracts which I assume gives the mask its fresh scent. After one use, my skin looked incredibly glowy and a little bit brighter. $3 for one mask. You can get it at looksinmayusa.com. Enter alert 20 at checkout to receive 20% off your order. Uh, valid on orders $35 and up from August 1st to October 31st. So again, we got this mask. The Pixie Rose Oil Blend Face Oil. The First Care Activating Serum. The H2O Gel Cream Moisturizer. This Botanical Primer for skin balancing. This Bar of Soap. And this Floss Highlighter. So uh, that is an awesome amount. Got seven products all together. So I would say I got my money's worth. I think that they did a great job, and I cannot wait to try these products. I've been wanting to try more Pixie products because I hear a lot of good things about them. Again, um, there are going to be some changes to this box. If I don't make an actual video about it, I'll just insert a picture at the end of this with the email. If you are new, please subscribe to my channel. Turn your notification bell on. Give this video a thumbs up and leave a positive comment. I do appreciate it. Remember to have love in your heart, put a smile on somebody's face, and do something kind for somebody because you never know how much it may mean to them. As always, I love you all so very much, and I'll see you next time. Bye.